Authentic happiness is your natural state. It is what you feel whenever you are present in each moment. I love this list because it is simple. You can focus on any one of these elements to help you find your way back into happiness. Each one represents a common thread, a sacred teaching across all world religions. All three are the pièce de résistance. Truth, love, and appreciation are what ignite our innate happiness. They are what we must aim to live. I secretly come back to each of these best life practices often throughout the day. They help to ground me in what is truly important and to live as my highest self. I hope that you will treasure them also. We all wish to live more of our life happy. There is no need to look outside of yourself for this. And just as we dive into this list, I want to guarantee this. For all of the moments in which you embrace these three life practices as a way of being, you will feel authentic happiness. When you are no longer in a state of happiness, notice which of these three best practices you need to return to. Call to mind one or all of these, and you will immediately reset how you feel. Use this magic formula for feeling happiness now. Let truth, love, and appreciation illume how you live life. Let's dive in a little deeper. Number one, truth. This means being truthful to yourself and to others, truthful in your word and of your actions, of how you approach and live life. Truth as your integrity, truthful in what you tell yourself, because what you tell yourself you believe. Number two, love. Be love. Be love in your words and actions. Be love in the thoughts that you hold, that are directed within and unto others. Open yourself to living in a way that is loving and kind. This is how you consciously calibrate your energy to vibrate at a higher level. Love is what you exude as positivism. As you seek to be love, you affect and attract the same in others. This perpetuates a feel-good vibe and a state of happiness and joy. When you are love, your energy is attuned to that of your inner being and the energy of Source, Universal Consciousness, God, the Divine, and whatever word you use to represent the most pure and godly aspect of you. This is how you become light energy and love. To be love is one of the greatest secrets of how to live life. And third, appreciation. Appreciation is being thankful. It is feeling gratitude. Your appreciation and gratitude makes it possible for you to feel happiness easily. For whatever mood state holds you hostage from your happiness, witness how you feel as you are in awe of the beauty and abundance that abounds all around you. And as you notice and appreciate the many blessings of your life, appreciation reminds you of the precious nature of the present moment. Gratitude allows you to enjoy and cherish what is in the present. This enriches your experience of everything. See and appreciate the beauty and magic in the ordinary. 
this is how you feel happiness easily. And finally, here are the practical ways to live each of these three life practices and to make them a conscious and deliberate choice. Number one, uphold truth. Look for the ways that you can be more honest and real with yourself and, of course, with others. Being wholly truthful honest and transparent forces you to face what you fear, what you are avoiding, and what ultimately holds you back from living authentic and true to yourself. Uphold truth, whatever it may be. This is how you move out of the uncomfortableness of uncertainty, fear, and anxiety, and into relief, understanding, and acceptance. One of the best strategies to alleviate anxiety and depression and to shift your mindset when you feel any uncomfortable emotion is to ask, are my thoughts 100% accurate and true? Most of the time you will need to upgrade your level of honesty and fact-finding to be able to tell yourself what is true. When you focus on what is true, you will have the ability to make what changes are needed in order to best help yourself. Give truth presence and attention in your life. When you become lodged in thoughts and perceptions that are untrue and inaccurate, you suffer. Be impeccable in your speech and in what you reveal to others as your truth. Number two, begin each day with the practice of being kind and loving with yourself. Explore ways that allow you to feel happiness with self-love and self-care. Use words of kindness spoken inward and aloud Embrace the sacred habits and rituals that care for and honor who you are. And of course, to practice the kind and nourishing self-talk that encourages and supports you. If you are ready to dive even deeper into the practice of self-love, to learn and uphold new best practices, and the behaviors and habits that will support and grow self-esteem and confidence, and to feel and know what it means to have self-love, you must check out the Self-Love Wisdom Toolkit. It is an ultimate guide to teaching self-love and for living the habits and the best practices that embody love of self completely. It is something that I have created for you. I will leave a link for you in the description. And third, be in prayer or meditation for 10 minutes before you officially begin your day. Reflect on the many blessings of your life. This is gratitude. It's best if you write these and, as you do, say them aloud. Then feel the presence of happiness that flows from within you. Allow this positive energy to uplift and inspire you. Feel blessed as you continue throughout each day to look for and find all of the ways in which you have abundance and blessings here and now. These are the ways in which you feel authentic happiness easily. Thank you so much for listening. This is Dorothy. Namaste.